Canada Nigeria Business to Business Conference 2016. Can you give us an insight into what it's all about? So the show will be taking place in Canada. It will be taking place in Toronto, in the city of Vaughan. And it's, um, it's going to be hosted on between the 5th and the 7th of October 2016. The aim of the program is to promote the um, or to assist the government's agenda which is to diversify the economy away from oil and gas now in the face of this diversification what key areas of the economy would this conference be focusing on um so we are going to be looking at a variety of um of key areas well or key sectors if i should say well i would probably say the um some key sectors that we'll be looking at are um, ICT and telecommunications, agriculture, banking and finance, um, education, and and infrastructure, um, infrastructure developments. You mentioned agriculture, infrastructure, as well as um, ICT and telecoms. You're correct. Is this conference also going to take a look at areas that are so critical, like um, energy and power, for economic? development. Yes, you're very correct and that's those are part of the um, key sectors that we are going to be looking at. As a matter of fact, we've spoken to a few Canadian organizations that are on board and are going to be coming to this trade show and are going to be, and we're hoping that they're going to be interacting with some key members of the government agencies over here or private sectors looking to diversify into renewable energy or Alternative energy, rather than what we and what we're currently using in the um, in the current in, the, in our current country at the moment, and then and we're looking to see how what partnerships can be done to merge those two the two countries together. Can you let us into the Canadian end of this event? Canada is a multinational uh, cultural um, nation. So, which of the Canadian province and who within the Canadian government? would be part of this conference? Um, so Canada is a very similar country to Nigeria and well, this um, this event is going to be um, hosted in again Toronto in the city of Vaughan and you know the office of the um, of the mayor of Vaughan is very much participating in um, in this event and the city of Vaughan welcomes every all participants and exhibitors from Nigeria. Now uh, Nigeria is naturally endowed with enormous tourism potentials. Do you think that this conference can help Nigeria to activate and um, maximize its tourism industry in order to help develop the nation's uh, economy? Um, you know, over the last um, two, three weeks, we've been, um, we've been all over Nigeria. We went. We went to Kano a few days ago. The team went to Kano. We also visited um, Ocean State. We went to Emory in Cheshire. We went to Ekiti. We went to Iko Dosi. And Nigeria has it's been blessed with the most beautiful landscape. And what we what we have felt or what we're not doing right is promoting it. Canada has oil. Nigeria has oil. Canada has renewable energy, Nigeria should have renewable energy. Canada is massive for tourism. Why shouldn't Nigeria be um, big for tourism? If you travel th three times a year abroad, one of your holidays should be an home based. How do we expect the leaders of tomorrow to, to learn if we're not promoting our own natural tourism? And, um, or tourism amenities available. So, well, um, we have the um, the um, we have members of the Nigerian Tourism Board coming. We have um, members of the Canadian Tourism Board that are going to be available over there, and we're hoping those two teams can combine together and learn what Canada has done to attract millions of customers to Canada and what they've done to get it right. And we're hoping that we can bring that back home, get it right amongst we Nigerians first. And hopefully, there's nothing stopping people from Ghana, Senegal, South Africa coming to Nigeria to enjoy what we have to offer from a tourism point of view.